Mm. Not looking pretty, that's for sure. <laughs> so, good morning, guys. 5 a.m. here in Vegas. About to head back to Orange County, and uh, I didn't want to be one of those kind of people that goes <clears throat> radio silent after a, a loss. It's part of the game, a very ugly part of the game, <laughs> but you know, there was a lot of battles going into this fight. We all had battles 2020, and I'm making no excuses, that's for sure. But one thing I really wanted to say was. I wanted to dedicate this fight, not the best fight to dedicate to someone, but regardless, a lot of people are gonna be watching this, whether I won or lost. I wanted to dedicate this fight to Nico Jackson. He was the son of Eugene Jackson, my first MMA coach, who taught me a lot of things and is an amazing man himself. Unfortunately, Nico died a few months ago this year. He was only 29 years old. And he was a great guy. He was an MMA fighter. He fought for Bellator and some other promotions. I came up with him on the local level back in 2000, I don't know, nine, I mean, sorry, like 10, 11, very young, before I went even, before we went pro. And um, Nico's death has been with me this whole fight camp, you know, and, and regardless of the outcome of the fight, I'm so appreciative because we start to take life for granted. And no matter what happens to us this year, <laughs> we're still here, right? We're still here. So think about that, guys. There's a million reasons to be sad, but we're still here. So I'm gonna heal up. This is all surface level stuff. That little, little boo-boo on my finger. I'm actually getting spine surgery on December 14th. So that's something that I was dealing with. <laughs> but uh, like I said, no excuses. Super happy to have gotten in the cage again after a year and eight months or something like that, almost two years. And I'll be back, you know? This is not my last fight. It's not my last fight with the UFC. And thank you for all of your support, all the fans, all my coaches, all my teammates my partner, Mike Wilson, I love you so much. And um, I'll be back. So I'm gonna keep my head up, ice my face, <laughs> get this surgery and appreciate life no matter what, because even though Nico's not here, we still are. So be happy guys, appreciate that we're still here. And that's it, talk to you soon.